Franklin Hall was a Pentecostal faith healing evangelist best known for his emphasis on prayer and fasting. In 1946, he published a book entitled Atomic Power with God Through Fasting and Prayer, which provided detailed information on the methods and the benefits of fasting. Many of the faith healing revivalists in the latter reign and voice of healing revival used Hall's fasting methods in their meetings until they became way more extreme. Hall wrote several books and tracts about fasting, including Glorified Fasting, The Fasting Prayer, The Body Felt Salvation, Formula for Raising the Dead, and Our Divine Healing Obligation. During the time that William Branham toured with Little David Walker, Franklin Hall joined in the faith healing campaigns. His fasting method, along with Branham's extremist doctrines, were the catalyst for the creation of the Latter Rain Movement. Hall recognized the massive amounts of money flowing through the revivals, and he even joked about it before the meeting started on live microphones. What are you going to start it with? I'm going to start some money. Some money. Oh, good. I'll help you start. All right, so that's fine. Franklin Hall's religious views on fasting grew more and more extreme, however, and many evangelists in the revivals did not want to participate in starving themselves. When the Latter Rain movement began to die out in the 1950s, Hall blamed them for their lack of fasting. Hall began claiming that participants in the revivals should have a, quote, body felt salvation, implying that if they weren't starving themselves, they weren't really saved. The hunger pangs, according to Hall, would eliminate sickness, tiredness, and body odors. As a result of Hall's extremism, his audience quickly faded. In 1956, Hall founded the Deliverance Foundation, a new cult formed around his Gospel of Fasting. By 1970, it reported 32 affiliated churches and 2,000 members. He also introduced new Little David-style child preachers to his stage act, such as Little Joey. You can learn this and more on william-branham.org.